When we found out we won the solve a project, we just freak out. So this is our story. We are just two architecture students from La Universidad Central de Venezuela. We are very passionate about architecture and how it's capable of solving problems of the city through the creation of spaces for the people. Growing up in Venezuela can be difficult sometimes. As you might know, here there are a lot of problems. But because of this, we see the world in a different way. Now we see these problems as opportunities to do something. In this case, we are focusing on a slum and generating ideas to solve the problems inside of them. The fact that we have been working on this project as part of our community service for our university was the reason to motivate us into presenting the project on Solvi to try to make it happen. For those of you who don't know, Solvi is an accelerated project focused on finding people with ideas to make a change in the world. Incredibly, we were selected and we are very grateful for that because we really believe in this project. Now, with Solvi supporting us, we are able to finish the design and start collaborating with other professionals like engineers to have a complete architectural project and start the construction process hopefully in a second phase. We want to present here the final idea of the project we are already working on. We will be renovating one abandoned space in the slum La Ladera on La Vega. To know more about this context in this project, you can click here and watch that video. The idea is to create on the deteriorated part of the slum a sustainable public space with sporting and cultural activities. The sustainability isn't only about collecting water from rain and generating energy from the sun. We will talk about this subject more deeply in another video soon. This new space will serve as a border for this community. With this, we don't pretend to isolate La Ladera. The idea is to create new relationships between the city and the slum and also serve as a facade for them. Because we want to make a project that will respond to different scales and understand the slum as a whole as well as his surroundings. We decide to propose this border in this whole area following the natural topography of this place. But the project will only be developed for now on this section right here. This means that the project can continue growing in the future to complete the entire border. We will be posting a new video every two weeks with the entire process of this project. The reason of doing this is because we believe that we can show you how through architecture you can help another community in any slum. In this process you will learn to understand a context and identify all of its variables, know who are the professionals that need to be involved, generate strategies according to the needs of the context and more. So make sure to leave a comment down below and hit the subscribe button so you can be a part of the journey with us. Subscribe.